My name is Jean-Christophe Bonis, I'm futurist, I'm the French futurist. Uh, basically my job is to travel the world, to try to forecast any kind of technology and to understand their impact on society. I try to go in each continent every month and I try to understand the impact on society for the next 15-20 years. We are kind of um, uh, babies, you know, we are homo sapiens since more than 10,000 years. We are uh, now kind of uh, leading the world on the top of the alimentary uh, chain and uh, at the same time we are babies, not, uh, not very clever uh, with environments and anything else. We are still on this process of, of not taking care of anything around. Uh, and for me it's important to be able during the day to be uh, still uh, very young in the mind and at the same time to be mature. Peter Pan is definitely my, uh, my, best, my best collaborator. Matrix, uh, Terminator, all these uh, movies or books you can, you can read are um, now present. When you are looking around, uh, Skynet uh, is living uh, uh, on a daily basis in China, when you see some robots in the uh, States, when you see some robots in, in, in Moscow, uh, in, uh, in Russia, it's crazy what is happening. The main problem is the fact that people, daily, daily people, us, we are not understanding what is happening because it's happening so fast. The main point is to put back human people in the center of the game. We need to get back in the center of the game and to control the technology and to don't be controlled by the technology. Most of the people don't understand this topic and that's the main point for me in this science fiction day we are living now. If we can't do anything, today we have the power of gods. When you are looking uh, at what happened, uh, the writer from antique period, Greece, uh, from, uh, from Rome, antique Rome, they were writing and making a description of gods and today we have the power of gods. But if we don't have the maturity enough, enough eye to understand that huge power need to have huge responsibilities, we are dying as human and we are dying as planets. So the main problem today is the fact that we can do everything. We can create machine, we can give life to machine, we can transform the life. And all these things are absolutely crazy good and crazy bad. The main point is who are we to tell what is good and what is bad? The line between good and bad is totally different depending your culture, your religion and anything. My point today is to tell should we do anything because we can and we will try to answer this question by some example and to, to make people think about this topic. Time.